Hey, it's good to see you. And today we are in Target in the land of backpacks. <laughs> We're gonna take a look at the school supplies. I always love to start back here in the backpacks or this is where I like to end up anyway because we have so many crazy, <laughs> awesome backpacks. Look at that one. Ooh. <laughs> Let's look. Oh, look at this paisley one. That's cool. Isn't that pretty? Look at that. Oh. And then um, some schools do require the clear backpacks so they can you know, see what's in there. Um, those are kind of a bummer if you're a girl. You probably know why. <laughs> um, fortunately, my kids, um, their schools don't require those, but some of them do. Um, it looks like they have a couple of different brands of those. Oh, look at this cute little bag. Oh my gosh. That's adorable. I like that one. They have a lot of different brands. They have a lot of... Um, Puma bags. That's shiny. This silver one's cool. This is from L2D Love to Design Accessories. That's neato. The Gold Star Collection. Uh, 360 degree high visibility safety reflector, comfort padding, and a tech sleeve. That's all right. There's an Embark bag. I've noticed that more and more of the backpacks have the little thing you could put your laptop in. That's that's actually really convenient. Oh, I like this one. That's nice. And see again, you have your little thing in there. Or you could put a tablet in there or whatever. Laptop safe. This is um this is nice. This is from Swiss Gear. Oh, I like the uh, the rose gold zipper pulls and everything. Has a sleeve pocket designed to fit most laptops. This one is $54.99. That's really spiffy. I want one of those. Um, this one's cool too. I, I like the other one a little bit better though. And then we have a, a larger one here. That one is $79.99. Oh, this green one's cool too. That's nice. And then <laughs> over here we have all the colored ones. These are a lot of fun. All the ones with the little patterns. And like here, this looks like it was done with a spirograph. You remember those? I actually have one. I keep meaning to do a video with it where you put the ink in there and it spins. You know, you have the piece of paper in there. This one has bowl, it has avocados and bowls of guacamole. <laughs> These are Jan Sport bags. Oh, look at this. Oh, that is so cute, little, little dog. Here's one with donuts all over it. It even has a swinging donut. Don't eat that one though. There's one that's a little different. Another donut bag. Oh, this one's on clearance as is for $6.96. It must be. I don't know what's wrong with it. There's something. Must be something wrong with it. I don't know. Oh my god, this one is awesome. Oh, I want this one with all the cats on it. <laughs> Look at their faces. Oh, Lord, there's Pumpkin. Look at that face. This is the coolest little bag. And now here's one with flowers. Nice floral design. Or you can get one with strawberries. These designs are great. We have butterflies. What's this purple one? Ooh, I love that holographic bottom to that one. Look at that. Neato. That is nice. These look like they're all around $35.99 to $39.99. And then you have just the plain colored ones here. And we, oh, of course we have a pineapple bag. And they have the laptop sleeve as well. We even have a Space Jam bag. Huh. And then, you know, they just have the solid color. If you don't want a splashy pattern on it, you can get a like a seafoam green or a navy blue. It has that brown bottom to it. This purple one's nice. Or you could get a salmon colored one. This one's kind of a charcoal gray and a black. This one's kind of a mustard color. Hmm, if I had, well, if I were still in school, honestly, I would probably just go for a solid color like this. Just, I don't know. That's, <laughs> I mean, the other ones are cold, but, you know, if I were really picking for school, I'd probably go with that one. 
Um, what is this? Locker decor. And this is why I love Target. They have everything laid out. Oh, we're not done with the, the bags yet. We'll go look at those in a minute. One thing I love about Target is how many things they have out here. Like, would you look at this? You could put in your locker a magnetic LED tassel light. <laughs> I want to put this in my office. <laughs> I'm not kidding. It's battery operated. How much is this? It's $14.99 for this little tassel light. Or you could also get a magnetic LED prism light. So it's got a magnet. You just stick it in your locker. Put some batteries in there. Or you could even get a magnetic LED light box that says going places. What's this? That doesn't go here. Speed dial. Oh, that's a... Look at that lock. Check that out. I've never seen a master lock like oops like that um it's not any of these they might have picked it up somewhere else and just set it here i don't know where this goes if i spot it in my travels i'll come back and get it let me fix the display here that bugs me we also have little um what is oh my god they have a disco ball i want to go back to school just want to put a disco ball in my locker you can also get a magnetic LED firefly light. Oh, oh, I don't know if you can see that little picture right there, but it lights up like fireflies. Ooh, nice. These are, how much are these? They're $9.99. And they also, somebody stole a pen. They also have a disco ball. <laughs> I would so put a disco ball in my locker. It's battery operated. Um, I think it's $14.99. You can get gold LED string lights, battery operated. These are all from Locker Style by U Brands. Straightening that a little, just a tad. Oh, here it is. Lord, I'm blind as a bat. It's right there. They have a red one too. That's $9.89 for the speed dial lock. That's nice. And this is the kind I always had in school, just a little plain combination lock. It wasn't even different colors. You could only get them in black. You couldn't pick different colors. We have the little magnetic LED puck lights, which if your kids are like mine, they'll turn it on and forget to turn it off and the battery's done. And then you have your little mesh bins. Of course, they have the big magnet on the back, a utility cup. This one has a little mirror on it. Little cups, and then we even have magnetic mesh half cups. You can put a succulent in your locker. They might think it's something that's not supposed to be there, but little do they know. And we have clip magnets. God, you could just really trick out your locker. We have geo magnets. Oh my, are you, are you kidding me right now? A fur rug for your locker. Seriously? This, I want to go back to school. I want a locker. You can do, you can do wallpaper. You can wallpaper your locker. Holy moly. I'm sorry. I'm really sorry. So does it, is it sticky? It doesn't say. I'm hoping it's easy to remove at the end of the year. And they have different patterns. Ooh, I like that one. <laughs> I am tripping out over this stuff. Look, you can... <laughs> you can put a pom-pom curtain in your locker. <laughs> oh, no. Locker style. A pom-pom curtain. I would go so crazy with this stuff. They did not have stuff like this. Pom-pom magnets. I want those for my refrigerator. Those are cute. Little furry magnets. And right now it looks like all this stuff is... Oh, buy one. Get one 25% off for locker decor, pencil pouches, and Yubi. But it does exclude more than magic. They have a little magnetic pennant whiteboard under here. With a, a tiny, adorable little um, cork board. And then you can add shelving now that would be nice some extra shelves for your locker what's this thing a fully adjustable locker shelf wow nice 
I'm going to tell you right now, none of this stuff existed when I was a kid. This makes me so jealous right now. I'm telling you, I'm so jealous. What's on this side? More locker stuff. Oh, this is neato. A magnetic photo grid. That's cool. It has little clips on it. You clip your pictures to it, and it has these magnets on the back. Oh. And a locker accessory kit. Oh, that's pretty. Or you can get one in gold and marble. And more little mesh cups. And, and of course, they all have locker, uh, magnets on the back. Oh, I want to put this on my front door. My front door is metal. A magnetic uh, pineapple hook. I'd like to use that at like a reef hook or something. That'd be cool. I want that. And we have little square magnets. We even have clothespin magnets that are extra snazzy. Those are only $2.99. Photo frame magnets. Those are cute. <laughs> you could put a you could put a tassel rug in your locker. <laughs> and here's the fur the fur rug again. I don't believe that actually. That is multicolor something. The rug goes over here. That rug just kills me. And we have some pink shelves, a gigantic magnetic oval mirror. <laughs> where does that go? I don't know where that goes. You can get little magnets that look like stickers. You can get you a pineapple bulletin board. That's cute. Okay, I'm being invaded by children. Hey, they have new uh, Minecraft bags. That one's cool. My younger son had a Minecraft bag last year, but he didn't want to use it this year, and he didn't want another one. He wants to use one of his old book bags. This one's cool. He would like that one, I bet. I'm not going to try to change his mind, though. If he doesn't want another bag, I'm not going to get him one. Here's one that looks like game controllers. <laughs> oh, they have a Fortnite bag. He would love that. And you have the little Fortnite dances, of course. You have your superheroes. Here's a Toy Story 4 bag. That's cute. And a Nickelodeon slime bag. I heard they just launched some slime into space, or they're getting ready to. Where'd all these people come from? Oh, and then over here you have your little water bottles, your reusable bottles, and we have cool thermoses. Check that out. There's Woody and Buzz. A little Pikachu thingy. Oh, this one's cute. A little, little mermaid on there and your ice blocks. Here are the bigger thermoses down here. Lord, those things are expensive. Um, that's like my old water bottle that was in my gym bag that got stolen. Mine was purple, but it was just like that. I might get another one of those. I really like that water bottle. All right, now they're tearing stuff up. I figured there wouldn't be anybody over here looking at uh, school supplies yet. Here's a something. That's certainly colorful. Oh, Lord, look at that. Ooh. <laughs> Fierce. Yes, it is. Golly, Pete, that is. Little boofy ball. And here you have the D Disney princesses' dresses. So there's a, a whole bunch of naked princesses running around somewhere because we got all their clothes. And this is from the um, Secret Life of Pets. Look at this furry bag. This is from Ugly Dolls. I never saw that. There's Princess Jasmine. I recognize that. Um, oh, that one's cool. That's a little tail. <laughs> Oh, this one's nice. Look, it's glittery. And it looks like it's been airbrushed. And we have a, this, this book bag is not only furry, like this part is plush. You also have mermaid sequins up here. And it has a bonus hood that folds, the hood, the hood folds into the pocket on the back. That's cute. So when you're wearing it, you can you can uh, put the little hood on. That's that's adorable. Oh, here it is. Somebody's pulled one out. It's really soft. The only bad thing is you're not going to be able to wash it. Oh, now this bag is cool. This is blue velvet. 
And look at the little stickers we have on here. This is only $19.99, and I want it. I have no use for it, but I want it. So we have a little Pizza Saturn and a rainbow and a mermaid sequin lightning bolt and a no drama llama. That is so soft. I like it. Oh, they have a black velvet one too with stars on it. And here's a psychedelic llama with tassels and I don't even know what all. And here's another holographic bag and it has mermaid sequins on the bottom that when you turn them up they're silver push them down makes a rainbow we have a cute little lunch bag that got lost somewhere he's sleeping we're gonna, we'll leave him alone we haven't even really gotten into the school supplies yet i'm waylaid by the bags a little kitty bag with the quilted uh, material i didn't see these over here Oh, that's cute. This, these are from Cat and Jack, so I'm guessing these are for the smaller kids. You have little unicorns and a little unicorn zipper pull. You have a panda parachuting. <laughs> that's sweet. And a little pretty yellow bag with rainbows and a little, like a little, a kitty cat with no face dingle ball that hangs from the zipper. Here's this, um, this one is seafoam green with hearts. Ooh, this one has sharks. I like this one. And it has it even has a little baby, a little shark thingy. Neato. Alright. Ooh, that's an interesting one. These are Cat and Jack also. This one has planets on it. Here's a camouflage bag. This one has little silver stars and moons on it. And a striped one. Lord, they have a lot of um, choices here. This one just says love on it. Oh, this is a sweet idea. Lunch notes from me. And each note, I guess, has a little thing on it like, Wacky fact, the world's most popular fruit is the tomato. And laugh, what does a cat like to eat on its birthday? Mice cream and cake. Pretty bad. So we have wacky facts and laughs, riddles and giggles. And these are in Spanish. And those are $4.99. How many? You get 101 notes for $5. I want to get some of these for my son. I can sneak them into his lunchbox every day. He prefers to take his lunch most of the time. Down here we have ice packs that say, We Rock. Somebody's pulled them down. Here's one that looks like a unicorn. I think they're just assorted up here. Let's see. Here's a little panda again. He's either parasailing. He looks like the, maybe he's parasailing in the unicorn. You can get your little sandwich cutter. Now, that is one thing I never did. I never cut my kids' crusts off their sandwiches. I never did because I didn't want them to start expecting that. I told them like my mama told me, you need to eat the crust because that's where all the vitamins are. <laughs> The crust is going to make you big and strong, so you have to eat that part. <laughs> and I believed her, so she never had to cut them off. This is me. This me. Ice pack. And they have little bento boxes, too. These are all from Cat and Jack. And see, you can just put little stuff in there. You have your little compartments. They have purple ones. It says yummy on this one. It's kind of a green lid. And this one is cool. This has a dark green lid and it's camouflaged. I wonder if my son would use those. Although I already have some stuff kind of like this at home and we never use them. Um, problem is, they don't fit in his lunchbox too well. Let's see. Over here we just have extra stuff. Um, we have book bins. These are $2 for the small ones. They look like the thing in the freezer that holds your ice cubes. A paper tray for three. A cubby bin for three. A multi caddy storage thing for three. Little class caddies. These are so cute. Okay. Over here we have the pencil cases. Oh, here's a Hogwarts one. That's cute. Oh, I really like this little, that's cool. I really like the multicolored one. 
they're all mixed up, aren't they? Look. Here's one of those zippets. We looked at these at uh, Walmart. Thing is, I'm not sure. Uh, these are zippets right here. The zippets go here. There's another one back there. Wild animals. Been shopping in here. Just, they just pull stuff down. This one's broken. Like, you know, I don't know. Put a smile on your case. These are cute. You have little fabric bags from Zip It. These are neat. These are $5.99, I believe, unless I'm looking at the wrong thing. Oh, no, these go right here. They're $7.99. The Zip It's go up here. And then these, these are the ones that are $5.99, these little plain ones. those and then you have these here's a five star pencil case but um no I don't believe that goes there where does the five star stuff go lord we have over here I found Maria's look Jenna Whispering has a pencil case check it out she totally does <laughs> I just accidentally pulled it off the thing let me put it back okay Trying to see if the five star stuff is over here. I know I'm probably looking right at it. It is. There's five star stuff right there. This one's cute though. It has, I like the fact that it has mesh on the bottom so you can see what's in there. Ah, uh, that's five star. And again, I know I'm looking right at it, but I'll be darned if I see it right now. These are nice little flat ones like this. And they have them in so many colors, too. Ooh, Flexi Storage. It's an expandable pencil box. That's neat. Um, I don't know what goes where over here. That's neat, though. They have them in... Oh, it folds out like that. I've seen little collapsible things like that for camping, like little collapsible sinks and whatnot. All of these are falling off of here. See, it looks like they're, they're sliding down, like they're sliding off of here. Them up, they're just gonna fall again. It's almost like they're too heavy or something. I don't want to get bogged down doing this, but I feel bad just walking off and leaving it. You know, there. here's a cute little small five star double zipper. That one goes here. There. Here's a Mead pencil pouch. That goes up here. Yeah. That looks like the ones we had when I was a kid. They, they look kind of like that. Ooh, these are a mess. I don't know. Oh, these are neat. Look at this little pencil, a school supplies box. It's a little, just a little metal tin. Oh, they have some that look like Sheriff Woody. <laughs> So I guess that's what happened to him after the end of the movie. <laughs> Sorry, it's not funny. Um, yeah, they have these in all kinds of colors. And they have Hogwarts cases. I don't know if that's where these go or not. They're all over the place. Smart, sweet. Sawinator. I do not know. I am too old to know what all this stuff means. You don't have to tell me because it doesn't really matter. And this is my kind right here with a boom box on it. That's me. Like the ghost from Pac-Man. Mm-hmm. Oh, hey. It's this. Ooh, it's squishy. That's cool. Oh, this one looks like a little pair of sunglasses. I like the UV stuff. It's really cool. Look at that. I need that for my older son because he's a teenager and that's the way he looks at me all the time. Oh my lord, look at the collection. Look at the selection of um, dry erase markers up here. My word. Look, now these are these are like the ones that we got. They're $8.69 here. You know what? They're cheaper here than they were at Walmart. They were nine something at Walmart. We'll be doing my older son's um, back to school shopping here as soon as I get his list. They have two in one dry erase markers too. And that's kind of cool. Here's a bonus pack, four plus one. 
up there. And then they have the up and up. I mean, actually, they're no cheaper. That's four forty nine for five. And here at the, the expo were five for four forty nine. Or you can get a big pack of just the plain black ones, eight of those for five seventy nine. See, I'd just go ahead and get the eight pack because you can get eight for five seventy nine. Well, I don't know, that's five. I don't mean anyway. Not a lot more. We have triangle cork tiles. Where does that go? Hex cork tiles. These are triangle. I don't know. It's pretty cool. Here comes a rolly cart. Oh, well, actually, um, this right here goes up here. There we go. Oh, chart. I've never seen this. Chalkboard colored pencils. Is that just a brand or what? A chalkboard pencil. Huh. Okay. And then you have random stuff like rubber band balls, scissors. Oh, this is what I should have gotten right here for the teachers when they wanted the assortment of post-it notes. I should have just gotten one of these. That's the Miami collection. That's cool. Oh, look at these putty, pretty, meh, putty, I taught a tall putty tat. Pretty push pins. <laughs> Neato. That's all right. I just wandered over here. Um, they're putting out stock. I had to move. Look at these. Now, these are nice notebooks. These are college ruled, five star, five subject notebooks for $4.29 and they have the, the poly the flexible poly cover that doesn't tear as easily and look at all the glue over here we have glitter glue um, in all of these really cool colors we have pink and blue and purple red and they're all they're all wonky there we go like that I like we're playing a video game over there, but they're putting out stock. You're trying to hide. You don't go over here. This is washable clear glue. That actually goes down there. But they also have this product. I've never heard of this. Um, Elmer's Magical Liquid. You add it to the glue to make slime, and it replaces baking soda and contact solution. Hmm. And for one container of glue, you only need a quarter of a cup of this stuff. And it's $4.99 and you get over eight ounces in there. Nice. And here we have glow in the dark glue and blue and pink and the traditional yellow glow in the dark color. We got a lot of that, don't we? I don't know. I feel like standing them up. Yeah, I would tell you, when I was a kid, none of this stuff existed. You just get a plain old bottle of glue. This right here. Just regular old Elmer's school glue. That was it. We have, we have avocados working out, getting fit on the folder. I think they actually came from over here. Let's see. It's not from Mead. It's from a different company. Or I don't know. It might come from down there. See, they also have the poly folders. I love the way they have them laid out. This is so much easier than the way Walmart does it. We have non-pronged folders, pronged folders, and all these colors. And here are the poly folders. They have a wider variety of colors, too, than Walmart does. And then you have the five, the five star folders. Where'd this little fella come from? These are all spiral notebooks. Oh, that one's cool. <laughs> this is how I roll little uh, roller skates. Lots of spiral notebooks too. I didn't need a single spiral notebook this year. The sound effects of these employees are starting to get on my nerves. It's like I'm being followed around by an old person's phone. You know, they, they turn their notifications up really loud. It's 
it's hang time. We have a little Polly folder from Toy Story 4, which is actually not a bad movie. My younger son and I went to see it. Oh, these, these folders are cool. They're kind of clear. Yeah, I know both of my parents. They, um, well, most of the time they leave their phone turned off because they're paranoid about the battery going dead. So if you ever need to call them, you can't because they never have their phone on. But when they do, they have the sound turned up so loud it will startle you every time they get a notification. <laughs> Ooh, look at these felt tip pens. Papermate Flare. Those are cool. And then we have these. We have a big pack of these for $26.49. You can get all, all these pretty colors. Dang. Gel pens. Where are the ones I like? They may not be over here. I don't know. There's a certain type of pen I like. And that's really all I use. We have our reinforced filler paper. This is your loose leaf paper, although it's reinforced. So this is one of the heavyweight packs. They're $2.99. Lord, you can get five star paper. That's six dollars, but you see how thick it is right there? Yeah, the holes are reinforced. I don't think that's necessary. I just get the plain old cheap paper. Doesn't I don't think it matters. Oh, I still think these are cool, but they're not as cool as Trapper Keepers. The little binders with the handle on them. These are these are from uh, Five Star. I mean, they're okay. And that oh, they have some from Mead as well. Let's move these over. I like this blue one here with the neon on it. That's nice. I like I like that color. I like that color combination. That's cool. And then we have Mead. Big old zipper binder there. It's too big to fit. And we have standard binders with, oh, they have gold unicorns on them. And they have this invisible one. It's just a floating sticker. These are flamingos. These look like fun. You, you can get dogs in space. <laughs> That looks like an acid trip that just went horribly wrong. I mean, look at all. You can't tell me these people don't do something. They use something. They're snorting something when they make these things. And then you just have your plain Avery. Is this Avery? Yeah. Avery folders. That's a pretty color. A three inch binder. Those are only $6.49. No, that's the one and a half inches, $6.49. The three inch binders are usually like eight or nine dollars. Um, the two inch is seven forty nine. Yeah, the three inch ones are down here. They're nine ninety nine. Yeah, they're usually they're usually pretty high. Here's a random five star thing sitting out here. Planner accessories. So you can you can even decorate your planner with stickers and whatnot. You can put a sticker for the first day of school, back day of school, or the <laughs> last day of school class field trip. That's nice. You can get a first aid antiseptic stick. If you need that for your first day of school, I don't, I don't know what to tell you if something's gone off the rails. All these lunch boxes are nice. Oh, I like the plaid one. That's pretty. That's $14.99. Or you can just get a little basic one here for $5.99. I really need to get a bigger one for my younger son. The one he's been using is just, I just don't think it's big enough. Like something like this right here. Here's a an igloo cooler bag for $13.99. That is a bit bigger than what he used last year. And it has a nice rubber handle on it. I wonder if they have a, oh, there's a red one. He want that one. I might get him one of these here and he can put a water bottle in the little pocket on the side too. He does like to take a water bottle sometimes. Oh, this one's even bigger. I don't know if he'd want one that big. That might be a bit too much. They have a little backpack to match that one. But he's getting to that age where he doesn't... He wants more grown-up looking stuff. Like, you know, he doesn't want stuff that looks like little kid stuff anymore. Um, because he has a Minecraft lunchbox. It's not quite like that, though, and 
I think he's kind of moving away from, you know, like lunch boxes like these and more into lunch boxes like these because he's, he's, he's a big kid now. So he, he wants uh, stuff that looks a little more, a little more grown up. It's bittersweet, but you know, it happens. It's part of life. Oh, they have all kinds of sketch pads, drawing paper, little sketch notebooks. Ooh, that's trippy. What's that? Astro Bright's paper. I want to get some of that for the wish list. This is a huge pack of brightly colored, multicolor, uh, multicolored paper. They asked for some of that. It's $8.99. Hmm. And you can get packs of uh, letter, letter size printer paper. And like I was mentioning in my video earlier, that's going to be 8.5 by 11. Which I think A4 is... Uh, eight by eleven and a half or something like that. It's a little different. In graph paper, you can get it with reinforced little thingies where you could put it in your binder. We didn't look at the composition books. I was over here looking at the uh, the graphing calculators. I had to buy one of these for my older son last year. God, the one I got him was like $120. It's crazy. But the good thing is it still works and he can use it again this year. So here's a little kiosk. What is this? more than magic. Well, that does look rather magical. I have to say, these accessories are nice. You can get furry things. Oh, you can get a, a purple glitter ruler. Little unicorn pencil bag. Lots of sparkly stuff. You can get a rug. You can get a locker rug in purple with sparkles. If Charity were in school, it's probably what she would decorate with. And little composition books here. Or a jumbo journal. Oh, I like these notebooks. Look at that pattern on there. Neato. No, this is for Charity right here. Look. <laughs> Sparkle wherever you go. That's all right. Sparkle wherever you go. I oh, know. Okay. So we have some more notebooks over here. That one has an interesting pattern. It's almost like it's been splattered with bleach or something. <laughs> I think it's I think it's supposed to look like that. Um. Oh, look at these! Oh, you got to be kidding me! Look at that. It's like little dogs, but they're unicorns. <laughs> That's awesome. And a slap bracelet. It's also a ruler. Look at that. We have more unicorns up here. In my eyes, you are a unicorn. Oh, there's a, oh, there's a llama, or is that an alpaca? Chewing gum, life of the party. How do you do an eye exam on a llama? Do you judge how accurately they spit at you? You know, I got spit at by a llama one time. I was out in a, a sheep pasture and we were trying to tow a Volkswagen bus out of there. It was a, it's a long story, but I got spit on by a llama. Passing notes. Well, what happened was, my dad knew this guy that had a Volkswagen bus, but it was parked out in the middle of his big pasture, and he had just left it out there. And it was, had a bunch of sheep in it and a llama. And he said, if you go out there, I went with my dad. Ooh, here's a five-star flex. That's kind of weird. The rings won't break. I've never seen one of those, I don't think. So anyway, we went out there, my dad and I went out there, we were gonna tow the bus out of the, the pasture. Well, the llama didn't like us being out there, so um, he kind of stalked us the whole time we were trying to get the bus ready to tow, and he just approached me, very matter-of-factly, and spit on me. <laughs> he just said, screw you, get out of my, get out of my pasture. But we got it out of there. And I had a bus for a while, but I couldn't afford to do the repairs on it that it needed. So I sent it on I sent it on to somebody who could afford it. Yeah, yes. Oh wait, that's college rolled. That, that's why I rolled. Those do go there. That's the right spot for it. Little composition books. And your spiral notebooks. So we already looked at the folders. We also have, here are your little planners here, your little journals. 
Oh, they're not planners. They're just, okay, they're journals. Go and explore. But do it before you go back to school because then you'll have more time. Here are the planners. Over here. That's a neat, that's an interesting cover on that one. All right, so we've seen most of the stuff, I think. And of course, since you have the remnants of summer, over here in the corner you have tiki torches and whatnot. And, oh, there's a little fire pit thing, that's cool. An outdoor fire bowl. All right, but I think, I think we've looked at most of it. Um, we will be coming back here as soon as I get my son's school list. I do not have it yet. I'm hoping I will get it soon. That one comes with headphones. That's cool. Yeah, as soon as I get it, we'll come back. And we'll, we'll, um, we'll do some shopping. And so we're going to see all this again. So um, anyway, thank you so much for watching. I will see you again really soon.